Hi, Yugis. How are you? <laughs> Happy to be here on the mat with you. Today we are going to work out a little bit balance, a little bit of our core, and I hope you enjoy today's interesting flow with me. With that being said, let's meet on the mat standing. Standing in the middle of our mat and just let the body relax, you know, bring in your attention in words, feel your body. That in the next 20 or 25 minutes or so, we're going to just work out our whole body a little bit more focused on our core, on our abs, on the balance, but you will feel super activated. And it's a very interesting flow. Hope you guys enjoy with me. Now let's inhale, lift arms up, very lazy, lift them up. You can even shake your body side to side, bend your elbows, just feel the side torso strengthening and the stretch. On your exhale, bring the right foot behind the left on the side and we'll stretch towards the left side. Pull the right um, wrist with your left hand. Just a gentle pulling towards the left. Feel the entire side stretch on the right side. Gaze up. Open your right um, elbow to the sky. Open up so that your gaze can be up towards the sky. Take a inhale here, exhale. Well, just bend forward, push the booties backwards, keep the legs the way they are, and just humble down. We're just in this curtsy pose. And then when you are at the bottom, bring your hands together like holding a basket of water with your hands and lift your body up, 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 up. This, feel the stream of this energy brought up by your hands, by your arms, will come into a standing in the middle of the mat again. Exhale, hands together at heart center. <sighs> we'll do it on the other side, hands up. Very lazy, soft. Feel your body again. Left foot all the way behind the right. The side stretch on the left. Pull the left hand over towards the right. Open the chest towards the sky. Gaze up. And inhale here. Exhale. Curved sit pose, push the booty back, back, back. Humble down, bend over at the bottom. Bring the hands together like hold water with your hands and bring yourself out into standing. Feel the uplifting strength and energy and now bring it to heart center. We'll come up to the top of our mat We'll come into a forward fold. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, push the booty back, knees slightly bent. We'll come into a forward fold. On this forward fold, just bend your knees one at a time. Walk on the spot. Stretch the hamstrings. Take an inhale, halfway lift. Lengthen your lower back, your upper body. And exhale, bend forward fold, fall deeper. Now inhale, bring the left foot back, 45 degrees out to the side. A warrior warm pose in the legs. And from here, lift your body up. Arms follow, warrior one. Right knee bend. 
square the hips to face forward of our room. Arms up. From here, we'll just come into an airplane. Bend your upper body forward, forward. Keep your uh, lower body in the same position. Arms extended out towards the side like an airplane. Very strong upper body and lower body. Keep the core strong. We'll come, we're training the balance and a big core here. And from here, take inhale. Like what we did in the courtesy pose, sway your arms up by holding water in your hands and lift your upper body up and back into warrior one. We'll do this four more times. Exhale, come into an airplane and swing your arms. Lift them up, inhale and exhale. Inhale, arms up. Exhale. One last time. Hold the hands and push through both feet. Lift your body up and we'll come into an airplane pose and we'll stay here. Very strong legs. Push through both feet. Take an inhale, exhale, bring the hands down on the mat. And we'll pivot the left toes forward and mm, tuck the toes and lift the right foot off the floor. Bend, bend the back and bring the knees towards the chest. And from here, gently push the hips back into a three leg downward dog. And gently come into a plank pose with the right leg still lifted. Bend the left knee. And keep the right leg lifted. And then we'll just come into a bit of spine move. Exhale, bring the right knee in around the back like a cat. <sighs> Inhale like a cow. Bring the right foot, like hook the right foot towards your head. So cat, knee into the chest. Inhale. Lift the right knee up towards the sky. Chest open. Two more times. So. In. Inhale, and from here, we'll just lift our left arm up and cross the arm all the way to reach our right foot. You can hold through the inside of the right foot or outside of the right foot at your own choice. Open your left shoulder up, externally rotate your left shoulder and lift your right knee up. Open the chest. Release the hands. And bring the right foot to the outside, to the left side of the mat. And reach your arms, your hands, also towards the left corner of your mat. Feel the entire side stretch on the right side of body. Like we did in the standing pose. Now move the hands back to center and reach the right foot back. Place it in the mat, on the mat, and we'll just push your body back and forth to strengthening and stretch the right hamstring. Once you are ready, push through your hands and your right foot into the mat and bring the left knee into the chest. Round the back. 
round, 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 and bring the left foot all the way in front, underneath your gaze, in between your hands. We'll come into a warrior, warrior one pose on the left side, and lift your body up, arms up, warrior one. Square off your hip. Take a few rounds of breath, as much as you can, to adjust yourself. And we will do the airplane wave on the side. Inhale, arms up, exhale. Bend your body parallel to the ground like an airplane. Push through both feet. And swing your hands all the way in front of you and bring your arms up. Inhale, exhale, airplane. Inhale, hold the hands up. And exhale. Two more times. In. And out. Last one. In. And out. Arms extended out. Hold in this airplane. Very strong legs. Exhale. Place the hands down. Get pivot the right toes. Bring the left knee in towards the chest. Push the booty up into three legs. Downward dog. <laughs> Extend it out the left leg and come into a plank. Three leg plank. Bend the right knee. Place it down the mat. We'll come into a cat and cow wave with the right, with the left knee lifted. Cat, bring the left knee into the chest, round the back. And cow. Oh. Kick the right, the left foot into the sky. Bring the left knee up and bring the left knee in the chest. Bring the left knee up. Imagine you are kicking through the heels and also in the meantime, lifting your left knee up, up, up. In, four more times, out. Stay here, lift your right hand, cross over to reach your left foot. Externally rotate your right shoulder, kick the left foot up, 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 and release. Place the hand down, place the left foot all the way across the right to the right side of the mat. Bring the hands also to the right. We'll feel this side stretch on the left. <sighs> Super juicy, stretchy, and oxygenate, oxy, oxygenated. When you do this long stretch, we'll come back to center and now place the left foot back, just sway a bit side forward and back to stretch the left hamstring. Once you're ready, come into a tabletop or just come into a regular cat and cow to release any tensions in the spine, in the lower back, in the neck, some organic movement in the spine connecting to the next half of our flow. Now bring yourself to child's pose and from child's pose round your spine inhale and bring the, your hips down come into a cobra. So we'll wave like this. Cat and child's pose Inhale, round the spine, way all the way to the front of the mat. Dip your hips down into cobra. Inhale. Exhale, child's pose. Inhale, way forward. Dip your hips, open the chest, cobra. 
last time. Charles Hope. From this cobra, we'll slowly wave our upper body down onto the mat. Place the forehead on the back of the book. Extend your arms out in front of you and your legs behind you. And from here, we will do a superman pose. Take an inhale. Exhale, lift your arms and legs off the floor as high as you, as you can and keep them lifted. And from here, um, in this pose, you have to um, keep in mind that you have to pinch your glutes in, like if you hold your glutes, they're super tight and pinched, and tuck your tailbone down towards the mat, and you can feel your Cubic, uh, uh, cubic bone touching the mat and pushing down. So very strong here. In the Superman pose, take the inhale, exhale, cactus the arms and bring the chest even higher off the floor. Inhale, arms extended out, exhale, cactus your arms. Inhale, two more times, cactus higher off the floor. Inhale and exhale, relax. Take a big inhale out through the mouth. And then bend your knees, swing your arms around your body to hold your ankles. Keep the knees close to each other. Take a big inhale, exhale, lift the heels up towards the sky and your chest off the mat, come into a bow pose. Your core is the same as before, pinch your glutes muscle and pubic bone down to the mat. Exhale, release. We'll come into a kneeling position. Come a slightly in the middle of our mat and cross your hands behind your lower back. Take a big inhale, push the hands down towards the mat, lift the chest up to the sky, neck, drop back, open the chest, exhale, bend over and bring your forehead towards the mat down on the mat, and your hands all the way behind your head. Shoulders stretch, release any tensions in the lower back as well. Feel the stretch. Your forehead very heavy into the ground. Release the hands. Gently push yourself up. And now come into sitting in a hero pose. Bring your glutes, your hips inside of your feet. So your feet are slightly outside. Um, and then you'll sit your glutes totally inside, your feet on the mat. And now from here, Come slightly, little by little, all the way back. Come onto your elbows, if you can, and drop your neck, drop your head behind you. Open the neck towards the sky. Or if you can, if your uh, flexibility and the knees allow, you can go down till you lay your back on the floor. Extended your arms out in front, out behind you. And you feel the entire front side of your body, including your hips, your groins, your sides, your quadriceps, stretching. We'll stay here for five rounds of breath. Now 
more gently. You do the way you did when you come down. Well, just push yourself, push ourselves up onto our elbows and come into a kneeling and come to place the hands in front of you. We'll tuck our toes behind us, knees close to each other. We'll come into a toe squat, knees off the floor. We'll balance on our toes. So this is a very challenging balancing pose. It's probably the most challenging balancing pose in this flow. I'll just, we'll just do um, a few quick breaths here. Hands together at heart center, focus. You guys at one point to keep the balance, to help with the balance. Take inhale, exhale, twist your body to the right side and hook your left elbow outside of your right knee. And just keep the balance. It's a balancing and twisting pose. Inhale, come back to center. As you can see, I'm shaking. Keep your spine tall and twist to the left. Right elbow hook outside of your left knee. Inhale, come back to center. So sit yourself down. Sit yourself down and we'll come into a boat pose. Legs bent. Legs can be bent or straightened if you, if you want to challenge your core. However you want. Or if you want to challenge a little bit more, uh, two-piece fingers to hook your big toe and extend your legs out. Straighten the legs, open the chest up, shoulders back, shoulder blades pinch together, step your belly in, keep the balance, keep, keep, keep. And now we'll release and we'll come into our, onto our back with our legs lifted 90 degrees. Arms extended out in front of our head. So our body is like an L shape, like this. And from here, just try to move with both of your toes, um, both of your feet and the toes, trying to draw the circles a few times clockwise. Make sure your lower back are uh, grounded on the mat when you do the circling. A few times anti-clockwise. This is good for the core. Once you are done, come back to center and now take a big inhale, and exhale. Close yourself into a bow shape. Wrap your hands around your shins. Inhale, extend your legs out into the sky. Arms out, exhale, bring it in. Inhale, extend, exhale, bring it in. If you want to challenge your core, you can Inhale, extend your legs out, diagonal, and bring it in. Keep your arms and your uh, head off the floor and your leg off the floor. But as close to the floor as possible, it is more challenging to the core. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Two more times. In. X. In. Exhale. Hold yourself. 
break the legs down, feet on the mat will come into a bridge pose. Inhale, place the feet close to your glutes, to your butt. Exhale, lift your hips up, 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 until you shape a bridge pose and cross your fingers underneath your lower back. Pinch your shoulder blades in. Open the chest even more to the sky. Your chin towards your chest. Knees close to each other. And when you gently open your hands, place your hands underneath your hip, hips and place your hips gently down to the mat, but place them on top of your hands. Your palms facing towards the mat, elbows close towards the body, extend the legs out and push through your elbows to lift your upper body up and drop your head behind you, open the neck up, or come into a fish pose. Gently release, hands on the side, along the side of our body, legs slightly feet slightly out, apart from each other, we'll come into this final asana, shavasana, probably one of your favorite, or probably the most favorite. Yeah, so that's it, this is the whole flow. I hope you guys enjoy it like I did, and I will be activated the body, or relax your body in a way, you know, this is the good about yoga. It's a workout and at the same time it's also very relieving and relaxing and healing. So you can pause the video um, and stay in this Shabasana for as long as you want. <clears throat> so the rest of us will stay here in a minute or so and I will wake you up when it's due. Take deep in your breath, shake your fingers, move your fingers and your toes, make your eyes open if you wish, or keep it closed. Just bring your attention back. Come to sit in the center of our mat, however you want. Arms up, hands together, bring it down to your heart center. Exhale. Thank you so much for being here with me on the mat, for taking out this time to give yourself a little bit care, a little, a little bit care, a little bit love, and a little bit fun time. I hope you enjoy.
and I'll see you in the next vlog. Have a good day. Bye.